Hello again, everybody. You may have seen that the winner of the BAFTA for Drama series is Save Me Too. And I'm pleased to say that Lenny James should be with us. Hello, Lenny. Hello, how are you doing? Hello, really well, congratulations. How are you feeling? Um, I'm a little dumbstruck, to be absolutely honest. I'm, um, I'm not easily surprised, but I have to say I'm genuinely um, surprised by this one. But everyone loved it. I mean, why are you so shocked? Um, because um, there was some really good, um, stiff competition and any one of them um, could have won. Um, and um, I think if, uh, I don't know, the, the, the good money probably wasn't on us. And Save Me was went down so well. How difficult was it to come back and, and make Save Me too, and to kind of keep that quality up? Was it was it tough? Um, to say it wasn't tough wouldn't necessarily be true, but it wasn't wasn't really um, kind of uh, uh, hugely difficult because I'd already knew what I wanted to do while I was doing the first series. I knew what I, wh what I was going to do in the second series should we get one. Um, I think the difficulty was shutting out all the noise about the first Save Me and um, and trusting in the story and not making changes um, based on what was popular or not popular in the first one. Is it? Does it make it any harder once you've seen all of the actors in the roles and you've you've been in it yourself and you've experienced that? Does that change how you how you write in any way? Um, that was a gift, actually, to kind of know what the characters actually sounded like and actually looked like, and that they weren't figments of my imagination, and that they were fully rounded by the you know the fantastic cast that we had. It was uh, it was a dream to know what Melon looked like and to know what Goz was like and to have Saran as Claire and and it was it was it was a just a, it was an absolute gift. And then to write the part of Jennifer um, uh, and get the actress that you wanted for it was just it was gravy. Question from the press room. What's the latest on the third and final chapter of Save Me? Um, um, it's got a boost today, that's for sure. Um, I, I'm, I'm working on it. I'm just, I just w want it to be, um, uh, follow, you know, to be a, a, a faithful third series. So, um, I'm getting it done, but the good thing is with this happening, there won't be any pressure on it. <laughs> just do you think it will make you sort of wake up upright tomorrow morning and think, right, I better do some writing. I probably should, shouldn't I? Um, a bit busy at the moment, but part of that being busy is um, working on the third one. Fantastic. And does it almost mean more to win for something that is so personal to you? Um, I don't know about more because it's, um, it's, uh, it's my second or third time being nominated and it's the first time winning. So actually, um, in a weird way, um, the one where I felt um, kind of m most uh um touch by was the first time we were nominated because that took us out you know that took us by surprise so i'm really glad that we've um that we've uh, got here but i i don't have anything to compare it to because this is a one-off how do you plan to celebrate well i'm in uh, austin texas and it's 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 not even 11 o'clock in the morning yet so i'm just wondering <laughs> where I have to pretend to be so I can have a lovely glass of red wine. And, <laughs> um, but I, um, I'm here, I'm going to speak to my kids, I'm going to speak to my missus, and um, I'm going to speak to the cast and crew when I'm allowed to tell them. And um, we're going to have a boogie, even though I might just be dancing on my own. Does that mean that you're, you're filming tomorrow? You're back to work tomorrow? I am back to work tomorrow, yeah, first thing. Okay, well, maybe they'll let you have a slightly later start, perhaps. <laughs> maybe I'm going to ask. <laughs> Fantastic. Lenny, thank you so much. Go and enjoy yourself. Congratulations. Thank you very much.